Merchant Services helps small business owners handle electronic payment transactions, which usually entail credit and debit card transactions, but can also include gift cards and other electronic payments. In today's video, we're breaking down the top five best merchant services to suit your small business needs. So let's get to it. Number one, Square. If you are looking for a merchant service provider that can do literally everything, then Square is your best bet. It has in-store, online, mobile, virtual, and QR payment processing. It's one of the few services that literally does it all. Another great thing about Square is the fact that it's free to use. Of course, you still have to pay a small payment processing fee as you go. However, if you're a small business without a lot of startup capital, then there really isn't a better choice. The payment processing fee is around 2.6% plus 10 cents for standard card payments, 2.9% plus 30 cents for online payments, and 3.5% plus 15% for mobile payments. There are no chargeback fees at all, and on top of that, you even get $250 as chargeback insurance every month. The only thing that you would have to do additionally is pay for a $50 card reader. But aside from that, it's hard to beat in terms of value and capability. And I'm gonna mention real quick that there are links in the description to all of the services mentioned in this video. These are affiliate links, which means you're gonna get the best possible price, and we may make a commission as well. Smart business owners know that they need to move quickly to grow their business, so definitely check out those links right away. Next up, Helsum. Helsum is similar to Square in a lot of different ways. So for example, it's also completely free to use and the transaction fees are even lower than that of Square. However, in terms of features, Helsum is lacking quite a bit. It does not offer nearly as many payment options and it's also not that good at protecting you from chargebacks. But first, let's look at their charges. If you have the card at the transaction, the fee is 0.3% plus 8 cents. If the card is not present, the fee is gonna be 0.5% and 25 cents. Those are the only two forms of transactions it supports. There is no early termination fee. However, if you do get a chargeback by a customer, you have to pay a $15 fee for every loss dispute. There's no insurance. Additionally, this card reader is more than twice as much money as Square at $109. So if you don't need that many payment options and you aren't worried about chargebacks, then this is a much cheaper option. Just do your research. Payment Depot is next. So Payment Depot takes a slightly different approach from Square and Helsum. Instead of charging you a specific percentage for every transaction, it uses a monthly subscription and a fixed rate for each transaction. So for card transactions, you pay eight cents, and for cardless transactions, you pay 15 cents. The monthly subscription charges are anywhere from 59 to $99 a month, depending on the volume you need. The card reader costs an additional $49. Overall, Payment Depot is a great option if your business is already well established and processes a lot of payments every day. It's really made for only high volume businesses. If you're a small business, it can be a bit expensive. You also don't get any chargeback protections as you would with Square, which is also, in my opinion, a negative. There's a $15 fine each chargeback case you lose. Next up, Stacks by Fat Merchant. Stax is another merchant service that uses a subscription model. The monthly charges start at $99 a month and they can go even higher depending on your transaction volume. But to make up for that, Stax has a lot of extra features that other merchant service providers don't give you. This includes things like invoicing, card on file payments, SMS text to pay solutions, white label customer portals, and reoccurring billing. The card present transaction fee is eight cents and the card not present transaction fee is 15 cents. You need to give a 30 day notice before you cancel a subscription and the chargeback fee is $25, regardless of if you lose the case or not. This is really only meant for small businesses with high volumes that need those extra features. Aside from that, you'd be better off with some of the other options like Square. Next up, Chase Payment Solutions. With Chase Payment Solutions, we go back to the free to use model used by Square and Helsum. The only difference is that Chase makes you sign a month to month contract, something that others don't make you do. Aside from that, the transaction fees are 2.6% plus 10 cents for card processing, 2.9% plus 25 cents for cardless processing. Thankfully, there's no early termination fee for Chase, but there is a chargeback fee of $25 for every chargeback, regardless of whether or not you win the case. 
The card reader also doesn't have any public price listing. And side note, if you do need merchant services, it can take up to a week sometimes to get your account set up. So be sure to get the ball rolling. Check out the links in the description of this video. If you'd like to watch a more thorough review of Square and its services, be sure to check out the video on the screen. And we'll catch you on that next video.